Good morning, everyone. Thank you for joining me today. And as you notice, I'm not in church. I'm actually in my kitchen. And as I'm here in my kitchen, I have something to show you. I'd like to show you my tomato. You see like that? And I've cut it in half. And when you cut a tomato in half, you find seeds. There's all these seeds in here. And what do you do with seeds? Do you just put them in your pocket or your, no. If you take the seed and you stick it in the ground and bury it, and give it some light and water and rain, it'll grow and become a plant. And that plant will grow more tomatoes and the tomatoes have seeds and it's more and more and more. I've been told that a tomato has between 50 and 200 seeds. So if one seed grows a plant with a bunch of tomatoes and each of those tomatoes has 50 to 200 seeds, that's thousands and thousands of seeds from one little seed that appears to die as it sticks in the ground and you think that's the end. But miraculously, new life springs out of what appears to be a dead seed. That's kind of like the story you'll be hearing in Sunday school today, where Jesus is talking with his friends and followers um, in his last days. He's in Jerusalem and they'll soon uh, arrest him and he'll die and they'll, and they'll bury him. And, and it's said, he's preparing to say goodbye. But he says that his life is like a seed, that even though it seems to die, that new life will come, that it's not the end of the story. And that's what we hear in this coming week. As we get in ready for Holy Week, we hear this story of God and this seed and Jesus being planted so that new life can spring forth, not just for him, but for millions and millions and millions of people afterwards. Trust God and trust in God's promise that Jesus is this seed and there's new life to come. And this is the story that we're going to be hearing. Um, you'll hear it today in Sunday school, but also in the coming week as we get really ready to celebrate Holy Week and then Easter. So thank you for joining and we'll see you soon.